Hey guys, what's up? Giving up 96 here doing a uh, video today. Um, this is uh, just an NYCC uh, shared exclusives um, box. Um, I was only um, able to get one, but it's the one I wanted the most. Um, and it's from Hot Topic. So, hottopic.com. They didn't uh, release them early in the morning like they usually do. It was more like four in the afternoon on Thursday two or maybe two between two and four but uh, I was able to pick up this one and i um, glad I did because now it's just like the predecessor before it where it's way too expensive that, that I would pay for it. but I got it um, I probably w will end up buying the other one that I'm talking about this box is a little dinged up, but that's okay. Um, but that is the um, SDCC uh, 20, I mean N NYCC 2017 Dragon's Ord here. Um, ooh. Ooh. The box is actually slit open. Well, slit. I don't care. Um, this is going to be mine anyway. I'm keeping it, so it doesn't really matter. And actually, because it's going to be mine, we're going to actually open it up and show you guys what it looks like outside the box because uh, actually this is my first 6-inch pop also. So a lot of firsts with this. Um, I do want to get the Megazord, but it's like 80 bucks right now. This is starting to jump up to like 70 80 which is ridiculous. Um, it's a cool pop, but it's nowhere near worth that much. Um, but, uh, I'm really glad that I got this one. Wow. The paint is absolutely fantastic. So, uh, here's the Dragon Zord. Out of the box. Um, they also did a, uh, black and gold version, which, uh, is a really popular thing that the legacy um, the legacy line is doing so I think that that has something to do with that that was a Toy Tokyo exclusive uh, Funko Pop for NYCC um, it's one that um, I don't really want because I mainly wanted this for what it was um, I'm also r currently looking for the metallic Green Ranger because I have the other metallic uh, line, the rest of the metallic line other than the Black Ranger, which who knows if it'll ever come out. It was supposed to come out in, uh, um, it was supposed to come out in last year when the red and uh, pink came out, but uh, never did. So I'm I'm just in awe over this pop actually. Um, so yeah, I don't have a Green Ranger in my collection only because I couldn't find the metallic and right now the glow in the dark one from this year's NYCC is about the same price as the metallic. Uh, went to my Walmart opening day, they didn't have any, so whatever. Um, got a little minor scuffages going on, but that's okay. This pop is just fantastic, I mean... Here's everything. Um, let's see if I can find a solid surface that it can stand on. Just to see if it stands on its own. I mean, twenty. it, it was 25 bucks for this pop. It wasn't a cheap pop. Um, but I'm very happy I got it. Yes. Stands perfectly fine on its own. Um, like I said, busted up box, but that's okay. I got what I wanted. Um, need to get the Megazord yet. Um, I would love to get the original uh, red, pink, and uh, red, pink, and white, but that's not happening. Those are way too expensive. Um, but I'm very happy with the pops that I do have. Um, I'm very happy to have this Dragon's Lord. It's so cool. Um, 
head rotates like all of them. Just wow. Uh, I mean, the pa paint isn't the best on it. You can see its leg, the the dragon zord symbols on its legs aren't the best painted, and the Z isn't that great. But um, I love this guy. You can see the scuffs on him here and here. But uh, wow, <laughs> this pop was definitely worth it to me. All right, guys, but uh, that's it for this video. You don't want to hear me gush about this pop any longer. Um, give me a thumbs up or a, um, comment if you want to see the rest of my Power Rangers line. Um, and maybe by uh, the time that video comes, there'll be a Megazord. You never know. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.